because my rifle's about to break. I wouldn't. I would rather it not break while I'm in the middle of fighting these things. Trying to see what the best course of action would be. Maybe getting the. Uh, oh. That took almost a quarter of my health. What the actual f? I think that one explosive spider went in the building like here come in the building with me so I can blow you up here you are I'm getting a lot of flops from these spiders, though. Those explosive guys, man, they're no joke. They are no joke at all. <laughs> Tomathan. <clears throat> My week, my week is always good. That guy's shooting a, a laser type that i never seen before. It's bright blue rather than purple or anything. Wonder how strong that guy is. So it seems to me the truly special feature of this area is not what you can loot, it's the spiders and how many flops you can get from them, because I'm getting over 100 flops per spider. What the actual F was that? He went through that. Yeah, he just like there's a schematic thing. Oh, Mark II Pulse Ex- oh. Okay, I changed my mind. 
you can get some good shit in here, <laughs> apparently. Oh, that's awesome. Let's see how good this is. Oh, wow. Okay. Customize. Okay. Okay, so. So my week, every single day is truly a blessing to me because I get to watch my kids grow up. They do something new. They do something special. And part of that, um, part of that, you know, is because of you and how you are as a person and how you treat them. And, you know, it's just... It's just awesome to have another human being smile at you every time you come into a room. They are really genuinely happy to see you every time they see you is the most awesome feeling in the world. Uh, so I get frustrated with the games I play sometimes. It, I, I get annoyed or angry. But overall, uh, overall, my day, every day is a great day. Like, I, I really, aside from having no money, <laughs> I, I really can't complain. <laughs> I get to do this. I get to hang out with you guys, and I get to hang out with my kids and my wife, who is the most amazing person I've ever met. I really truly am blessed. I have a really great life. I I can't complain at all. And um I feel like it it'll just only get better from here because I'll meet more guys like you guys hanging out in the stream and eventually I might be able to turn this into a career and I really look forward to that possibility becoming a reality. But if it never happens, that's okay too, because at least I tried. And I'm happy for the amount of commitment that I give to my stream every day and well, every day that I stream. And, uh, you know, I try to keep a schedule. I try to keep you guys aware that this is, this is what I do. I do mainly survival crafting, but I'll occasionally jump to other games and... Uh, you know, I, I keep you guys aware of what's going on in reality. I shouldn't say reality, in real life. And, uh... You know, eventually it, it'll, it'll just only get better from here. So overall, you know, I never really have much to say about my day because every day is generally the same. But every day is great. You know, no complaints from me, really. I look forward to uh, making this into a career and having a, enough sustainable money to where I can say that I have completed the goal of making this a career. I do look forward to that. But like I said already, if that never happens, it's okay. At least I tried. And I got to hang out with you guys and get to know you guys and, you know. Hey, thanks for uh, helping to level up the Guardians. Oh, I appreciate that. You know, if, there, if I eventually get to a point where I have a thousand viewers, I'll be super, super grateful. But if I never get to a thousand viewers, if I only have five viewers a stream, that's fine because you guys are awesome. You guys come in and give me somebody to talk to, which is 
the main reason why I decided to stream was to share in the memories of the game with you guys and to have interesting, good conversations with you guys and just hang out and have fun. That's three explosive spiders. I am not going anywhere near that area. Tempted to shoot at them to get them to, to lure them over here. Oh, solar panels. I'm off Tommy. I got some stuff I got to sort out. Happy silicon hunting. Thanks, Paul. Uh, thank you again for the following, man, and I, I hope the rest of your day goes well. seen that machine before and data subject clone clone t800 or 300 200 i can't tell what number that is yeah silicon I guess some people pronounce it silicon, or there was another way I heard somebody pronounce it, but... Actually killed it. Please let no more spiders come until I heal. Oh. Ooh. What do you mean I'm missing AE? And I'm bleeding out. Oh, that's the way you, way you say it. Oh, okay. 499 flops from that. Hey, that makes sense. That thing is ridiculous. Whew. Our carbon steel, nice. How do I get to the roof of this place? Oh, I see. I have to jump from the other building.
Well, you know how it is, Ginger. I just call it how I see it. Especially you, Ginger. I'm glad you found my channel and you get as much enjoyment out of it as you do. silicone okay so I'm gonna go ahead and take this off I'm going to move this over here and put where to go where is it there it is because it seems like for certain things you like materials uh rocks we'll just call them rocks you use the pulse excavator for the robots you use the cutting torch to get better resources that's what i'm getting from this because when i'm when i'm navigating through the rocks it's telling me use the excavator when i'm looting the spiders then it's telling me to use the cutting torch and i'm like <laughs> okay Yeah, see, so we got we got four flops and four silicon. So let's switch over to this. We did get a little bit more out of it. figure out how to safely get back down now. Okay, right here. Oh my god. Look at all those spiders. Okay. I want to make sure I've gotten everything out of this building. I think I did, but I really just wanted to get over there and get that silicon off the, um, off of that build. Oh, how do I get up on that building? There's more up there. Okay. Gotta figure that out. Okay, so it looks like I got everything out of this building. So, okay, this one... Wanted to check there real quick. I saw 
body there. Sometimes there's a gun sitting next to the body. How do I get on top of here? Can I build? I don't think so. No. Be nice. Silicone like an ice cream cone. Oh, silicone. Ah. expect him to get that close to me. <laughs> couple of those okay it's apparent like looting this area I need to have a lot of backup in the ways of healing You know what? I don't know how these work. I'd like to try them. We'll put this there. Actually, let's switch these two. And then where's the... Here they are.
that building and that area over there are the only two areas I haven't checked yet. There's so many fighters. wasn't paying attention to my weight. I'm like, slow. Slowing me down. Probably all the silicon. Yeah. Crafting cost, durability, that's the next weight reduction. Oh, 800, okay. And then that's the next weight, okay. So, hit this and this. Well, we hit this next, and then we hit this and this to get more weight reduction. I hope I don't have to go past these, though, because I, I don't have the schematics. I mean, I have them. I just haven't unlocked them yet. Okay. Uh, drop that. Drop that. Drop that. Drop that. Man. I really want the aluminum from that, but... Okay, we're really close now. <sighs> Go ahead and use this. It looks like four more. That one saw me. This one is going to do damage to me.
Triforce. What's up, man? How's it going? I am just tr trying to loot this entire area, but these spiders in this area are... Oh, shit. There's another exploder spider. Uh, okay, so we have two more exploding spiders down there. I know I saw one go over there. That guy saw me. Let's back up. He did quite a bit of damage to me. Um, I could go in that opening there and use it as a kind of protection from the exploding spider. Or from the, uh, exploder spider. But, uh, he could still get me. These spiders in this area are extremely tough and can kill me so easily. Okay, with one down. Did that exploder go in that building? Because if he did, I don't have to worry about him until I go in that building. There we go. Nice. There's a third spider, uh, third one that went behind that building. And then the one that shoots the rockets, I think, went in that building, but I'm not sure. Because if if I get both of them on my ass at once, I'm I'm done for. on top Yeah, he went on top of the building, which means he will be shooting me if I go to check the final building. And there's an explosive spider over there. I need to take this guy out. I don't see him. Maybe he's... Maybe he got stuck in the rock base. That would be, like, really fortunate for me. That guy need to take you out. Okay. This door is open here. Oh, no. Enclosed bases with spiders is not good. Good man, I just woke up. Nice. Hope your day goes well, sir. Well, it looks like somebody is doing experiments on the spiders in here. There's a 3D printer. Flops, nice.
Okay. Reflex sight. Heavy 6.5 millimeter barrel. Don't need that. Don't need that. Okay, so this game, uh, they were in the process of colonizing Mars, and they built these robots to help in the colonization, but then they turned against, they turned against the humans and started killing them and stuff, but you don't have any idea what's going on with that, like you don't, you don't know that right away. Uh, because you're a clone that was in a clone chamber uh, for hundreds of years and you wake up in the clone chamber you come out of the cloning facility and now like you're going to different areas learning about what happened and I suppose you're eventually going to learn about how they went bad who did it uh, like who changed them into evil killer robots and uh, those panels up there was my mission for today's stream which I already have a really decent amount Okay. They respawned over on this side. Here, two, three. Eight or three. That one saw me. I think. Maybe not. Move back up here. There are some big, pretty big issues with this game. Like, those shots were spot on. I know they were. They didn't do any damage. But... The most that they asked for this game was $20. I got it on sale for 5 And so the amount of content and everything for this game for even just 20 like this game to me feels like it should at least be a $45 game because the amount of content and how good this game is the environments the storyline all of it is excellent and the only problems I have are like small issues that I overlook because this is only a six month old game. You know, they're going to make improvements over time. And it it'll it'll become better. They'll they'll work out the bugs eventually. Oh wow, I have no ammo at all for this. Uh which building was it that had the 3D printer? Was it? It wasn't this building. Maybe it was this one. Building had the three D printer. Really, six months? Yeah, uh, it came out six months ago, and 
it's when you think about how many companies or individuals depending on what indie game you're looking at release these games that are basically in an unplayable state there you are And they charge you five dollars for the game but the game is pretty much unplayable that's where i compare the two because even though they originally asked twenty dollars for this game i got it on sale for five and so i take this five dollar game that i got compare it to other five dollar games that are basically unplayable and i'm like this game is worth way more than five dollars so then I compare it to the other $20 games that are out there. This game has more content than every other $20 game that I've I've witnessed so far in my life. And then I take and I compare it to a $45 to $50 game. That's where it feels like it's accurate. And so for them to ask such a small amount of money compared to what it's worth, I think is awesome. It's, a, it's definitely a Steam gem of a game, for sure. Uh, which was it? Oh, the sniper's rocket spider got himself unstuck. See him up there. I'm gonna go back and check the first building. I'm gonna loot that spider I killed first and then... See how much this is. One thousand two hundred and eighty with a heavy barrel. Okay, now in my skill tree. Okay, so I should be able to make that now using a 3D printer. I can't remember which building it was. It's probably, oh, there it is. Nice, okay. Where is it? No, not that one. I may have to make it in the uh, the big one, the big printer. I don't see it here. Hmm. Okay. No big deal. Uh, need, oh, that's right. Okay, um... 
Alright. I can't make uh, FMJ ammo. But we'll make... Regular ammo. Now it's time to leave. That was three exploding spiders, the most powerful spider in the game, which fires rockets at you and uh, will kill you extremely super easy. Uh, and one of the purple spiders, I believe, that was shooting lasers at me. So five spiders, <laughs> there's no way I would survive that. Um, had to get the heck out of dodge for that one. Oh, thanks for the lurk, Ginger. I do want to kill that one, but... I'm gonna lure this spider away first. They see you from pretty far away. Oh, shit. God, so many spiders. And that one being the most dangerous one. Spray. Where is it? There it is.
Okay. Next one I'm going to lure is this invisible one over here. Oh shit, that one saw me. Things are so powerful, it's ridiculous. <laughs> 